every morning. The New York Daily News gives me so much to run my mouth a mile a minute over. Take the governor of New York. I want to know about the budget, not his late night booty call. So can do it. Jet set is freakazoids. Gather round because I'm going to give you the video blast of what's in America's number one tabloid, the New York Daily News. New York Daily News headline says terrorism outrage. Schumer says we're not getting our fair share. White House says you're wrong. Meantime, the president is in town raising the ducats and the shimolis. I wonder if executives of Goldman Sachs will be showing up to pay tribute to the president. You can find out in the New York Daily News. Story two has Rick Glasio attacking Andrew Cuomo as being the second coming of Elliot Spitzer, that freaking steamroller. Well, out of the way. The war is on for the governorship. Take off the gloves. It's Lazio versus Cuomo. Yet when they were in Washington, the story says they were the best of buddies, Ukumbari Chichas. Read more in tomorrow's Daily News. Nobody writes about the geriatric express hill sipping psychotic killers of organized crime the way the Daily News does. Back to back, belly to belly. First story, John Gotti Jr. upset that a guy who testified against him is going to walk clean because he's part of Team America. But then we flip the script to Vinny. Hello, gorgeous Bassiano, friend of John Gotti Jr., but head of the Bonanno crime family. He's in the stir 23 hours a day, facing triple life without parole. He demands of the federal judge, I want to see my wife in one hour, and a half hour later, I want to see my gumbada, my woman on the side, and I want conjugal visits. And yes, because I have that tan, 247365, I want more canisters of man tan available to me in the commissary. The only place you could read that is in today's Daily News. Back page is sports. Phil Hughes, again a winner against the Tigers. But the real story was Javier Vasquez breaks the Cucalamunga streak by proving he can pitch well as a Yankee, not just in that other league. He loses 2-0 to the Tigers, but he pitches a great seven only in the sports section of today's Daily News. Whenever I read the New York Daily News, I get into flashback mode when I was a young little whippersnapper. Each day delivering 168 dailies, and on Sunday, a whopping 182. Oh, that's right, kid. Oh, hey, man. Thank you. Catch me five Fridays from now now. Pay for your college education. He stiffed me, but you know something? The Daily News never stiffs you. Front page, terrorist alert. Back page sports, Phil Hughes coming through as the number five starter for the New York Yankees. Does it get any better than that? Yeah. You get your gossip, Russian Malloy. Wow, Jay-Z rocking New York Yankee colors next to Eminem, rocking Detroit Tiger colors. And let me check my horoscope. Eh, Let me check it tomorrow. Anyway, all that and more each and every day in New York's hometown newspaper, The Daily News. Every morning, The New York Daily News gives me so much to run my mouth a mile a minute over. Take the governor of New York. I want to know about the budget, not his late night booty call. So can do it. Jet set is freakazoids. Gather round because I'm going to give you the video blast of what's in America's number one tabloid, the New York Daily News.